Hi, everyone. This is Amisha Grasty here with Maurice Lee. Hello, everyone. And um, today we're going to introduce to you the, the official Skew Grid YouTube channel. Um, this channel should serve as your first and only stop for Skew Grid training and video tutorials. Yes. Um, so when you run into issues with uh, anything that is skew grid from setting up your skew grid account to uh, something you may not understand, um, this is the place you should come to. Um, we have many videos that's going to be coming after the ones that have already been uploaded and we made it um, pretty easy for anyone to learn how to set up skew grid um, figure out certain problems because from the issues that we have been having um, with SKU Grid, we have come to find out that 90% or at least a vast majority of the issues that occur um, are pretty much user mistake. So to alleviate this problem, to alleviate this problem, uh, we sought out to create a video for every aspect of SKU Grid that um, a user may, may run into. So this would be the one, one stop shop, so to speak, for all of your answers um, with general and, and common uh, issues with SKU Grid. Absolutely. And the first thing that you'll want to do when you come to the SKU Grid YouTube channel is you'll want to, if you don't already have SKU Grid and you want to start a trial, you can click this link here to start a trial and you'll get 20,000 extra credits in your account to use for your repricing. Um, the next button here is so that you can join in the Facebook support group. And the next page is to like the fan page. And you'll wanna definitely subscribe to this YouTube channel because as Marie said, we're going to constantly be adding new training uh, and new tutorials to this channel. It's gonna be jam packed with information. And that way you'll get a notification uh, when we upload new videos. Yes. Um, also, um, this channel, of course, is totally free for all SKU Grid users and people who are just interested in, in learning about SKU Grid. Um, some people, before they even purchase um, uh, software, they would like to have training on it so they will feel comfortable with using it or confident in using it. And um, one thing that I want to point out before we get into the demo of, of, this, um, of this channel is that on many of the videos, especially in the beginning of um, the beginning videos that you're going to view, uh, many of them, if not all of, of them, I was narrating um, the instructions that Amisha gave to me. So um, the knowledge is from one of the top persons in the SKU Grid support team, which is Amisha. Um, she has been with the company since the very beginning. Um, some of you may have actually sent her support tickets. Um, but so the knowledge that is being recorded on these videos came from her and what she has learned from the, uh, the creators of, of the tool. And I can, you know, confidently say that there's no one that knows more about the tools than her, except maybe the creators of it, you know, so this is the place to go. I know other people have trainings out there. Some of it may be free. Some of them may be charging you a small fee you know, for their time to help you with SKU Grid, but this channel is, is free and it's for all users and it's from the knowledge is coming from someone who knows this tool, you know, front and back. So there's no need to go anywhere else and get confused because a lot of the issues that she has to straight out were, you know, quite frankly created by people who didn't fully understand how to operate the tool and they, you know, taught people the wrong way how to do certain things. So I just wanted to point that out. Even though you may hear my voice, um, I'm actually just narrating the instructions that she gave to me. And based on those um, instructions alone, I was able to learn a lot of things about SKU Grid that I did not know without even looking at the software. So that's just how good the, uh, the training and tutorials are because I was not looking at it at the time, you know, uh, w when I was um, going over the instructions. I later went over the instructions to make the video. And as you will see in the videos, I was able to do everything correctly based upon these instructions that she gave me. So I just wanted to point that out and for you all to make a note of that. The information is not necessarily coming from me. Um, 
is coming from her, you know, who is one of the top um, SKU grid uh, uh, on the port personnel. Awesome. And um, lastly, if you have any technical issues related to anything that you see in the training or don't see in the training, your technical support questions should always be submitted via support ticket for fastest response. I know that you'll have ability to leave comments in the videos. However, you know, that's not, comments in the video are not gonna be first priority. The first priority is responding to support tickets and that should always be where you go to get technical support. So I just wanted to emphasize that. All right, and now um, just going to give you some general overview about the channel. The channel is organized into playlists. So the first playlist is SKU Grid Getting Started. And these are videos to help you get started with SKU Grid if you don't already have it, how to add a trial, et cetera, um, how to estimate your usage in SKU Grid terms, what does eBay and Amazon repricing mean, um, also how to cancel. So, you know, more videos can be added to this section, but they will always be here under SKU Grid Getting Started. Uh, the next section is SKU Grid Setup. So this is going to be everything that you need to know in order to get your SKU Grid account set up and operating as quick as possible. These videos walk you through tab by tab through your settings um, so that you can get everything done and get a clear explanation of every single detail. Um, so a lot of them will have an overview, which is like a general overview of one tab, and then we'll break that one tab down even further. So um, if, you, if you look at the channel, the, the videos are always gonna be in order. You know, every, you'll just basically go down the list on the left, and then you can go down the list on the right. Or if you want to open the playlist up, you can click it, and then you'll see all videos will be in order here. Now this order may change as we keep adding new videos, but we will always have the order noted in the videos. All right, I'm gonna go back. All right, um, another section here is called SKU Grid Q&A. These are gonna be some general questions that people might have about SKU Grid. If you have a specific question, um, you know, like how to get your eBay keys, that's right here, how to change your repricing time. These are just general questions that people might have. So for quick Q&A questions, those little videos will be right here. You may see them, some of them are duplicated. They may appear in the Q&A section, but also in a setup section. So, you know, don't be alarmed by that. We're just separating the questions to um, allow easy access for those who might need it. Um, if there are more videos than are shown, there will be a show more link and you can click that and it expand to open up more videos. All right, um, and also we wanna show you, if you click on playlists, you'll be able to jump to any of these playlists fairly quickly. The videos tab will display all of the videos in the channel, um, but you know it's obviously more organized when you look at it in the playlist format. Lastly, if you click on the search icon, this little magnifying glass, you can type in a keyword. If there's something that you were interested in, let's just say your eBay keys or Amazon keys, if you just type in keys, then it will pull up all videos that have the mention of keys in the title or description that are within this channel. So this allows you to easily jump to videos that will help you with a specific issue. And that's about it, really. Yes. <laughs> um, one other thing that I wanted to note, um, when you open up a video, if you expand the description, you will, this is also helping with those who are hearing impaired. Um, all of the videos have captions um, noted in the description. You'll see the entire transcript of the video within the description so that if you have a screen reader or something like that, it can read the text to you um, if, you're, if you're visually impaired. And also um, for those who cannot hear but can see, um, you know, they can read the scripts that are here and follow along. So we're trying to make this as accessible for everyone as possible. Uh, one of the things that I wanted to add um, also is, uh, I think you mentioned about the closed caption on the video also, I don't know whether they saw it, um, but we have that on the videos while, while the videos are playing. Um, yeah, down at the bottom. Um, but the other thing is, as Amisha said about running into duplicate um, videos, uh, we wanted to make this channel uh, like a, a, a full course 
on um, SKU grid training. So some of the videos that we have, they may have duplicate um, material in there. And this is because we wanted those videos to be linked together, but at the same time could stand alone on their own um, if needed be. So you will still have a, a, a complete understanding of the topic that you are studying. So we wanted to create the videos where if you were learning how to get your keys, as she said, you didn't, didn't necessarily need to um, know the previous um, two videos in order to understand that one. So keep that in mind too. Um, and that also helps you to retain the information when you start hearing things in repetition. Um, again, as I was recording, I learned a lot of stuff that stuck with me just by going over some of the same um, sentences um, time and time again and then maybe only having to change one part to do something, uh, do something else that pertain to that particular topic. So I just wanted to point that out too. Don't become, uh, you know, uh, bored and feel like you need to skip that part in a video. Um, just go through it. And we intentionally tried to keep the videos under five minutes so, so that, again, you won't become bored and, and um, miss what you are looking for. So hopefully all of that um, will pay off to help you all um, better understand the tool and get the most out of it. Yeah, absolutely. And don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel <laughs> and join in the Facebook group if you haven't already. And we will see you on the other side. All right. Take care, everyone.